Hi, my name is Patrick and this is a video regarding how to prepare for CAT 23 if you are starting from August 23. Uh, we, this is a part of the four video series. First was a general video, general preparation, second con, this is DILR and last will be verbal. Right, let's look at how to prepare. I mean, uh, been training for more than 20 years, fairly comfortable with the exam. We do train for various courses like CAT and other entrance exams. So if you're preparing from August, so I would say that spend 50 days to complete your syllabus and maybe two months from September to November for practice and mocks. So basically 110 days. So this is your breakup. And your second level, that is the mocks become more important, practice becomes more important. The first you need to just understand the syllabus once so that you are comfortable with it. Okay, don't go too deep into the syllabus because uh, at least in DILR, when you go to the second stage, you'll realize the syllabus is completely different from what does come in the mocks. But syllabus helps you to build the foundation for the mocks as such. So first round, August to September, 50 days, spend one to two hours daily for practice of DILR. That's what is recommended as such. So I've divided the more time for logic as compared to data interpretation. Normally in the last two years, I mean one fourth on 25% of the paper is DI and the rest is logic. So logic has more weightage. So look at logic. Uh, but yes, the easiest set was DI, so don't ignore DI. Also just kept two, two days for each topic. So just so comfortable with this. So during these days, just take up a few things and just practice. I mean, you look at some topics that are both in logic and uh, DI. That is because the way the questions are framed, I mean, there is a bifurcation. If it's more data driven, it's uh, logic or DI. If it's more thinking based, it's logic. But yeah, there is a overlap between the two. So you can at least for right now try to get the fundamentals right during this particular period. Also, just be comfortable with the fundamentals because that will help you to solve tougher sums. Though this actual sum could be a little different from what you're solving right now, but this helps to build a foundation. If required, you can spend less number of days out here. Maybe instead of two days, spend only one day just to be familiar. And you can move to the second stage as early as possible. That is also okay. So every day take a few DIL assets, that's the way to solve. I mean, just to be familiar, the more you practice, the better you become comfortable and that helps. Also try to solve one puzzle a day, it could be Minesweeper, Sudoku, Kakuru, it are different puzzles. So one puzzle a day and calculations, same calculation what to do for con, the same calculation you can do out here, helps, helps because uh, though CAT has an online calculator, but practicing calculation helps to build speed in the examination. I mean, online calculator is not very easy to use. And all the other MBA entrance exam don't have calcium. I hope this is clear. Again, part of the four video series, general video, con, this is a DILR. And last we have is verbal. Remember the schedule. I've just given the topics. You can go to these topics and spend these days for, you know, the topics that we have mentioned. Thank you.